In larger organizations, it's very common that you find sales and pre-sales as two separate organizations. And that leads sometimes to misunderstandings or even like confrontation because either sales don't respect pre-sales or the reverse. But when you come down to it, all of this is pretty childish. If you're a traditional sales and you're doing technical sales, you know or you should know just how valuable that technical aspect that the pre-sales professional brings to the table. I mean, frankly, sales is the art of gaining trust. And the best way to gain trust in the tech sales transaction is to actually be technically accurate and trustworthy, quite frankly. And it's okay when a traditional sales doesn't know everything there is to about the technology, but somebody ought, ought to know it. And that will be the pre-sales. So obviously you want to have the pre-sales organization and pre-sales professionals on your side in order to be able to close business. But the reverse is also true. I mean, I heard sometimes people in pre-sales thinking that sales, basically they are not uh, carrying their own weight. And maybe some of them are not, but most of the time they are. There are people in traditional sales, they are expert at what they're doing. And it's too easy for us that are technical in nature to think that technical sales is only about technology. It's not, it's about people. It's about gaining trust, not only by knowing more things and by highlighting features, but also through human contact, through understanding what are the non-technology challenges that the clients have. And that's actually also pretty critical to close additional business. Bottom line, if you have two organizations that is sale and pre-sales, you need to think of yourselves as members of the same line in the hockey team. Uh, you're going to exchange a puck, you're going to do passes. That is all done so you can score. And the worst case scenario is that when the players on the same line just can't collaborate with one another, then guarantees failure. You want to have harmony and you want to actually leverage each other's strengths.